am so not used to starting off vlogs like this because I have a self tanner on and my face doesn't match my neck. It's Friday, it's after work. Just got off of work probably like an hour and a half ago. Put on a self tan and yeah, I was on the phone, I was like self tanning while on the phone canceling a reservation for like a hotel for a client. It was so funny, I was like sitting on hold and I was self tanning my body like hoping that they didn't pick up. But um, yeah, I was canceling a reservation for a client. It was like a busy work day. I was taking care of a bunch of stuff because two of the girls went on a trip today to Costa Rica. For one of the girls, I was monitoring her emails and um, following up with clients for like final payment for hotels and one of them actually wanted to cancel. So that's what I've been doing and self tanner is developing. I'm going to pick up some Chick-fil-A for Christian and I. I look just like kind of insane. I like braided my hair just to like get it out of my face. I didn't want it on top of my head in a clip like I usually do but anyways welcome back to another YouTube video. My name's Lauren. If you're new I'm gonna go get some Chick-fil-A for us for dinner. <music> it's the next day I kind of trailed off yesterday on vlogging because I actually <laughs> reorganized my closet so I like moved around my clothes like three or four different times and I think the way that I have it now is the way that it's gonna stay but after I got home and had chick-fil-a I was waiting for my self tanner to like set in and I took a look at my closet and was like mm this could be better. So I reorganized that. Here, I'll show you. It's gonna be hard to show you, but I like moved all of my little tank tops, going out tops, all that stuff. I got rid of my work section. My new job actually is way more casual for work wear, so I felt like I didn't need a whole section for just like my work clothes. So I kind of moved my work clothes into like the rest of my clothes. So put my tank tops here, and then I put like my higher baskets that have my sweatpants and jeans underneath the tank tops. And then I put my lower baskets underneath all of my like longer clothes. So I spent the, the evening kind of reorganizing that. My closet just looks so messy at all times. Eventually I would love to get a bunch of bins that just line the top so I can store stuff in it, but I mean for now this will do. I also cleaned my David Yearman jewelry. I get a lot of questions on the rings that I wear every day. I wear this one and then I wear these two. I basically wear them like in every vlog, but I have this one and then I also have this. And I just cleaned them. Look at all that that came off of them. I like to take them to the Yerman store because they do clean them for free, but they just started holding them overnight, and it's kind of just a hassle to go to the mall two days in a row to like pick them up. But so I just tried to clean them myself and I washed them with warm water and dish soap, and then I used this rag to get all the stuff off, and they are sparkling. I need to remember to start the dishwasher before I leave because I didn't want to start it before I started talking to you guys. But I just have a few things that I need to do. Let me fill up my car with gas. I want to get a car wash. My car is like really dirty. I have like three separate small, really small, Target pickup orders <laughs> that um, I placed. Oh, I think I'm going to make some banana bread today. I have all the ingredients. I have ripe bananas, everything. So I think I'm going to do that after I get back from running these errands and um yeah because i'm not gonna start that now i just want to get all that stuff that's outside of the house done that i need to get done 
but um, yeah, I'm wearing this cute tank top that I got from Cotton On that I showed in my work week in my life, I think it was. It's a seamless top and I love this cut and I love this color for spring and summer. I think orange is like my favorite color at the moment. I just love orange stuff. Like for a little while it was green and now I'm just like really into orange. So this might be my color for spring and summer. So I'm gonna go run those errands and I'll bring you guys along and then we'll come back and make some banana bread, which is gluten-free, dairy-free banana bread. And it's, let me just tell you, it's literally the best. It is so windy out. My hair. <laughs> okay, now time to go get a car wash, which is super needed. That's the car wash that I go to right there and it doesn't look super busy, which I'm so happy about. <laughs> to go from running some errands and now I'm about to cook the gluten-free dairy-free banana bread so I'm just gonna grab the ingredients out I need three I'll put the recipe in the description box just in case you want to make it it's really good I've made it before on my channel it's by no means my own recipe but it's really really good for being gluten and dairy-free let me grab all the ingredients to dinner i really wanted italian food like a big plate of or a bowl of pasta but we tried calling i tried calling this place called armando's because i wanted to try a new place and one of them is an hour wait there's i think three locations total but i only called two because the third location's really far and their menu just looked incredible they had such good stuff and i wanted to try it because i've never tried it and I called one, it was an hour wait, and then the second one, their phone is literally ringing off the hook. But we're going to this place called, I forget the name, it's called La Bella Luna. We've tried it before, but it's been probably over a year since we last went. last night I have the ballet body face tan water and it's not my favorite it hasn't been my favorite for a while I used it when I first started using my ballet body one hour express tanner which was probably almost a year ago now that I think I've used it probably around like 10 months so I've had this for 10 months and I prefer the Isle of Paradise um, self tanning drops over this because I put a lot on a cotton pad last night and I feel like it didn't even make my face tan at all. So we're gonna put on another layer of it and see if that does anything. I just reach for this more over this. So I don't know. I love their one hour express though. I've been using it for a while. I just can't get behind this face tan water. And I also wanna try their like actual tanning oil slash sunscreen because I tried it, when did I try it? I went on the lake a few weekends ago and one of the girls had it and I tried it and it's just so good. So I kinda wanna pick up some of that for the next time that I'm in the sun, but 
I'm just like not obsessed with the face tan water and I haven't been for just a while. It just doesn't get me tan enough and I feel like I do a lot of pumps. I'm gonna put on another layer and I'm gonna show you how I do it. Um, I never put any type of self tanner or anything on my upper lip because I feel like it just like automatically looks bad. You literally just take it and rub it around and maybe tomorrow will look better but and then make sure I like push it into my hairline but I like go around my mouth but I don't go like above I don't know how to describe that and I do the same technique with the Isle of Paradise I like just rub it everywhere with moisturizer and um, not on my upper lip and then I take it because it clumps at my hairline, so I take it and I like rub like a towel around my hairline and like kind of like buff it, I don't know. And then I make sure to like go over my eyebrows so that way my eyebrows aren't like orange. And I need to wash my hands. Now I'm gonna put on my moisturizer. I guess I'll update you guys in the morning if there's a result after second time use, but this is the reason why I don't use it because I feel like it sometimes shows color, sometimes doesn't, most of the time doesn't. So I'll update you guys in the morning on that. Okay, I'm about to get in bed, but I have to show you guys what I've been falling asleep to the past actually few nights. Christian and I go to bed at different times, so it's fine and it's not annoying to him. It's on right now because I fell asleep to it, but... It's like a cozy bedroom of rain in New York and it's so relaxing. I don't know if you can hear that rain sound and it puts me out, I swear, in like five minutes or less. It's so relaxing. I'll link the video down below, but just it's almost like you're there. Okay. It's the next day. I look a little oily because I just put on some sunscreen. Let me show you. The sunscreen I've been using, it's the Elta MD UV Clear SPF 46. I can link it. I get it off Derm Store. So that's what I've been using and that's what I just put on. I feel like my face looks a little bit tanner than it did last night. So I think the key to that Bally Body face tanner is multiple layers. Yeah, so this is the update. I think it looks a little bit tanner and glowier. But I am up. It's a little bit after nine. I'm waiting for Maya to get here. We're gonna go on a little walk around Baldwin Park. She has her dog, so I'm excited. It's gonna be a nice little walk. We're gonna get some coffee and yeah, just do that, so I'm excited. So I'm gonna change and put on Probably like a little set and put on some shoes and then we'll go on a nice little walk to get coffee. I'm excited. It's a little bit later in the day. Maya and I went on a morning walk, got coffee. I took a few photos, posted them on my Instagram, came back, I showered, put a little bit of makeup on, 
and then I'm like a little bit oily. It's so hot outside, so I look a little bit oily. But um, I wanted to get myself flowers for Mother's Day since my mom isn't around anymore. So I wanted to get flowers, so we went to Trader Joe's. Christian and I went and then picked up some flowers. I kind of just grabbed whatever made me really happy and um, whatever I liked. There wasn't a whole ton to choose from. There was a lot of arrangements that were already pre-put together, but I kind of just wanted a bunch of random ones that I loved. I had to get yellow because I feel like yellow is a super happy color. I love tulips and I thought these were so pretty. And then I just got some filler and then I got these because I really wanted another one of these yellow ones that they didn't have anymore. So I just got a bunch of different ones that I love. So I'm gonna put these in a vase. I still have the flowers that Christian got me for our four year anniversary on the table, but I have another vase that I'm gonna put these in too. And then we also got some green juices from this place called Nectar that's in the Trader Joe's parking lot. So it was really good. Just got back from the grocery store. I'm not gonna do a haul, but I just got a lot of fresh fruit and vegetables for the week. I'm about to cut up some lettuce and wash it, and then I put it in a bowl like this with some paper towels. And then I put a lid on it to keep it fresh. But what I do with these, because I don't go through three heads of lettuce, each week i put them in tin foil and they last like three weeks it says online that it lasts up to a month but usually around three weeks that's when it starts to just go downhill so you don't wash it you just buy it unwashed and you don't cut this off just leave it on and then you just wrap it in tin foil and put it in your fridge drawer and it lasts then i have fresh lettuce for a few weeks and it's nice. I know it looks crazy, but you just store it like this in the refrigerator and it stays good. It's like such a, a nice night out right now. And I'm gonna go pick us up some dinner. I'm trying to find my chapstick. I'm gonna pick us up some salads. I have been obsessed with this lip balm, the Laneige one. And I don't know if I, I got it in my last vlog. And I don't know, let me turn my car on. Um, I don't know if it's because it's the the flavor that it is it's gummy bear and it's so good that it, i literally want to eat it or if it's just it's super moisturizing as well and i feel like i prefer it over the other 
one because this one is just so easy. It's like a tube. And it's my favorite. And I don't know why it took me so long to try it, but it's good. Okay, I just wanted to go ahead and end off this video here. I just finished eating dinner and I'm about to shower and get ready for the week. Christian, if you can hear him, he's watching the heat game and he just gets really into those basketball games. <laughs> yeah, um, if you can hear that. So I'm going to get in the shower. I just wanted to go ahead and end off this video here. I want to relax for the rest of the night and just get ready for the work week. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you're subscribed. Give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.